Hello friends, uh, today I am going to demonstrate about uh, multi-channels uh, running on, on multiple, multiple peers uh, where we have got one uh, single channel which is publicly available and uh, other three p uh, channels which are private to the organizations. Uh, so let me explain you more about this uh, entire uh, setup in where um, we in this uh, organization we have got um, we have got four participants four organizations and uh, company one is the first organization which is the administrator organization here company two is the car rental service organization company three is repair and maintenance service company four is the bank and payment service organization so uh, basic idea here is the um, the fleet organization will register a uh, register and car uh, um, and request services from mo mod organization when the service is done and the mods organization can pay request payment from company four bank organization and company one administrative organization can look after all this uh, follow on the transition going on in this network so yeah so the channel all is accessible from all the organization and uh, channel free to fleet services and payment are private to each of them and um, this uh, each channel has got their own chain codes uh, which are running on on the peers and uh, they have got their own database cows db database as well so this is the basic uh, um, organization detail so going back uh, going to the uh, let's going to the organizations sorry uh, yeah so connecting the instance now so connected yeah checking on the process running on docker so uh, as you can see we have got uh, four peers uh, and uh, four cows db each of them and four uh, chain codes installed four chain code each chain code uh, for peer one for peer one we have got chain code uh, which is associated with the cows db as well so uh, cows db is running on five night uh, port number 5984 cows db1 is running on port 5984 and, and if we go to cows db 5984 this is the cows db installed here installed and running so likely is the same ways where we have got a private uh, three other uh, private uh, cows db instances docker instances docker process which is running so yeah so that's that's it so checking on the back going to the cows db we can see that cows db is running on uh, the chain um, chain code is uh, accessible to all channel so we have the four organization registered here which is accessible to the uh, so this is the front end to, to, to access the uh, details so if i log in with uh, car iq uh, the which is uh, which is in fact the organization which is the administrator organization and uh, i can go into in detail and get the organization details which are these are the four organization which are pre-registered with the organization and uh, this is the data uh, this is cows db database which uh, which is publicly accessible to all the organization right now so this is a so if i log in as fleet organization which uh, fleet organization has uh, fleet organization can register a car and request for service so right now i will be i will demonstrate how cows db data is saved in uh, in uh, sorry uh, the, this organization data is saved in a separate cows db which is not accessible by any other organization so so uh, this is the uh, this is uh, the port where the cows db is running for exclusive for fleet organization if i register a car a b c model red car type and register it is successful so if I go back to my instance uh, here on uh, in the fleet organization channel and I can see the data is just been saved here data is just been saved so um, this cows db belongs to 
fleet organization itself the so fleet organization so the fleet organization has uh, this channel working on this channel which has this uh, uh, chain code uh, yeah, chain code running and uh, uh, which is running on ps1 and the cows dp is 6984 so 6984 so the car has been registered first fleet organization the car, ha car has been registered so if i go to show car and the fleet organization this uh, this organization has got this car registered and if i go into view car and i can give uh, i can generate an event and register the event so the event is uh, been again been saved with the fleet organization if we go back i can see the fleet organization event been saved okay yeah this is the event been saved here on the fleet organization cause db so um, if i go back again to show car and i can view the uh, fleet organization detail here just now we have created an event and uh, we can request by uh, when a request a request service is generated uh, going back to the model um, our model when the request service is generated the service request is goes to the mod uh, organization which will be saved in this um, this cows db 7984 which is running on port 7984 it will go to the, this cows db so let me request, raise a request then service job and right so then saved going back to our uh what yeah so card if i uh, yeah i'm logged in as fleet organization here and if i go and check in the cars detail car detail i can see that a request service has been generated now the service is been saved directly to the um, directly to the mod organization so the mod organization yeah the service has been saved here and the mod organization is uh, a mod organization is connected with cows db2 2 is running the mod the chain code is running here on this peer on the p2 so if i logged in log in as mod organization now and check for services just service has reached here you can the mod organization can either accept or uh, uh, right now the accept button is there but uh, uh, eventually when there will be multiple organi mod organization then they will have this list and they can accept to um, accept the request raised so uh, actor x accepting the list is available now now the um, the mod organization the mod organization can actually accept it or reject it whatever they want to do they can do it um, so uh the service has been updated so going back the service is in progress right now by mod organization and if i go and get uh, the detail where the service has been created right now in i am um, inside fleet organization and fleet or, uh, inside the fleet organization if i refresh and go into checking the detail of the car i can see that the status is progress and who, who has accepted the uh, request it's also mentioned there modern mod, mod organization has accepted the request so the car um, the, uh, this request is, is an under process uh, i can see this uh, uh, when i log in as fleet organization so going back to my mod organization mod organization i can just uh, change the uh, service request to complete once the service request has been complete by mod organization the status is complete uh, when i am inside mod organization and if i go back to uh, fleet organization and check the detail of the service uh, it says uh, the, the service has been completed now after completing when the mod organization completes the service it uh, the service comes back to uh, fleet organization and uh, it uh, it will ask for whether the uh, the service has been successfully done so uh, the fleet organization has to confirm it so confirming it every and uh, this everything is happening on uh, 
this uh, this all the transaction is happening on peer, uh, on this uh, on this channel on this channel uh, on this service channel everything is every transaction is happening on this service channel and the details are being saved in this call db yep confirmed so cows db detail has been saved and in the front end key access it so once the, uh, the uh, when, once the service is completed by uh, the both fleet and the mod organization then then the mod organization can raise for request for a payment so this payment request will go to the uh, this payment request will go to the channel payments uh, payment channel this payment channel and it is uh, private to uh, bank organization so going back here request payment and it went further so if i go back and log in as bank organization i can see the payment request has arrived here mod organization has requested for payment organization so uh, directly i can update it so coming back here on uh, port 8984 uh, which is this couch db 8984 this is the cow db cow db3 which is associated with uh, bank which is associated with bank and uh, this peer so going back here um, yeah so going back here i have a request the data is been saved here so uh, it, it again goes back to the payment yes, sir. Uh, yeah this is the one the mod uh, i'm inside mod organization where i can see the card status and uh, everything is done from by the bank and now i can confirm it though the enter cycle has now completed so if i go back so uh, in this organization uh, as you can see that uh, um, there are four cows db instances uh, which are running and uh, each uh, uh, each cows db is private to one organization and uh, ch uh, channel one this cows db is uh, accessible by all the organization so if i go back to this uh, if i want to see all the details uh, which is the um, administrator organization here this is the administrator organization you can go back and see all the detail all the detail of that card can be viewed here so this is a very good example where uh, we uh, where i have demonstrated how multi chain channels are working with multiple cows dbs and uh, everything is working on hyperledger fabric 1.4 uh, thank you for watching have a nice day see you again bye